What was that? The horses are stuck. <laughs> Mom, did you hear that? I just want to get out of here. It's a fun squad. We're about to go on a ride. <gasps> Horseback riding. We're about to go on a trail ride with our horses. It's very exciting. However, we just heard some chatter that we're going into a haunted forest. So uh, it's almost Halloween. This will be very interesting. Hopefully, we're safe from mythical creatures. First time on a horse. Hi. <laughs> Fun squad right now. We're going horseback riding and we're going to ride around the horses. We're headed into the bush. Can you see them? What do you think, Kate? Pretty cool? Yeah. Who was scared when they first got on? The sun is setting behind the Tennessee forest. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Beautiful. All right, guys, we're deep in the woods in Tennessee. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I survived that. Out in the boonies of Tennessee, going through the in and out of these thick forests, and our guide starts telling us this ancient folklore story about some mythical creature who has evil powers. And his name is Eichlin, I guess. Eichlin? Anyway, apparently doesn't like to be seen, and if you happen upon him and he sees you, he'll turn you to stone. So we're, we weren't spooked, we were super excited when we got on the ride, but now the kids are super spooked. We're headed back into the forest, deep into the thickest, and we're hoping we don't see Eichlin. <sighs> Hang tight, guys. She said that a couple years ago, there was a rider that went deep into the woods at sunset and never came back. They never found a body. They never found any remains. And that rider just disappeared. The community didn't believe that there was an icon in the woods. And so the owner of the horse ranch just decided to continue doing horse rides anyway. So here we go. Did you see that? Yeah. You see that over there? Yeah. Guys, there's something over there in the bushes. The sun's going down and we're just starting to get more and more spooked. We asked the guide if we could turn back, but she said we were too far in, so we're crossing our fingers and saying a prayer that we're gonna make it back as the sun sets. just went down over the trees. We came to that last clearing and the guide said that right in this clearing were the footprints of the rider that went missing. They went into the woods and then disappeared. So now we're riding through the area where they think that maybe that rider went missing. So we're kind of freaking out here. My horse just took off riding. <gasps> oh my gosh. I see a head, a stone head right there on the ground. Do you see it? I don't know if you can see it, but it was right there. What was that? I just saw the bushes move. We just lost self-service and we have no way to call if we need help. I see a stone horse over there. This is definitely the area where they disappeared. <gasps> Guys, smash that like button to give us good luck and hopefully we make it out of here, right? Well, we're having a lot of fun still. What's up, fun squad? I am riding a horse right now. Look at that, and look, I'm like prancing like this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, anyway, we just got lost. And hopefully we can get back before creepy things start showing up. Out of nowhere, who knows? Zombies might show up. Looks like the tour guides lost the trail. <laughs> She's not sure where we are right now, and the horses seem kind of spooked. Did you see that? Jazzy's horse just keeps yanking at her and like seems to be nervous. We keep hearing like cracking in the bushes and just starting to feel worried. We just heard this sound twice. It was like a high-pitched squeal. I don't know how else to explain it, but like maybe a pig that's like in distress or something. I don't know, but it's so spooking me. 
There it is again. Did you hear that? Did you guys hear that? There it is again. All right, guys, getting off. Something happened. I'm pretty sure. Jesse's horse like totally spooked and jumped. Jumped through the water, and the guy was like, oh, I've never seen her do that before. I've never seen her do that. She got off, and she's checking her out to see if her, heat, if her foot's okay. Anyway, now we're, we're stopped in the middle of the forest, and it's just really spooky, and we keep hearing noises. I just want to get out of here. Are you okay, Jazz? Was that kind of scary? It's so dark. Do you think we're gonna make it back? I don't know if we, you guys can even see anymore. We can barely see it, but our guide says she thinks she found the trail. Hopefully we can make it out here without seeing the mythical creature. So spooky. Okay, we're seeing all these signs that just like are warning signs. They say do not pass and cliffs ahead. I mean, partly it's like spooky because here we are in the dark, but at least there's markings like humans have been here before. Did you hear that? Did you hear it, Jack? I hear that weird squealing again. Okay, guys, seriously, there's nothing like being stuck, lost in a haunted forest in October. Oh my gosh, in the middle of the woods. Did you hear that? My horse jumped. Thank goodness Jack's horse just spooked too, but at least it was just a deer. All right, guys, we did it. We're coming out of the forest and into a clearing and I can see the barn. There it is. Horses are so excited to be out of that forest too. I can tell they're like picking up the pace and headed towards the barn. Here we go. We're headed back. We're gonna make it out. Yes. Thank goodness it was just a cow. A baby cow out here by herself. That's so weird. Mom, this place is spooky. I'm gonna do a circle. Oh, the horse like wanted to bite me. I can't even see you, it's too dark. All right guys, we made it out. We are never coming back here again, ever. Mom, don't ever let us come back here. It was so scary. I can clap we found our way back on the trail. Mom, I wish we could stay for another hour. This place was fun. <laughs> Apparently Jack likes being freaked out. No, I just like riding horses. It was awesome. And we're finally out of here.